Please stay with me on this. Anyone, including this commenter, but anyone who agrees, this is not an attack on anyone, but anyone who has this sentiment that female rappers have made women more sexually promiscuous or showing off their bodies more, and I need you to understand, whether you're Muslim or not, that is an anti-black statement. Stay with me, stay with me, stay, stay with me. When you, I, or anyone hears the term female rappers, what is it that we picture? I guarantee, don't lie, I guarantee that you think of black women. Now, if we were really being honest, we know that throughout history, over the centuries, over the decades, long before rap music ever existed, long before female rappers were mainstream or popular, women have been taught by society, by their cultures, different reasons that are all nuanced and complicated and situated in history and movements of politics, very complicated stuff. We need some sociology PhDs to come in here and like talk about it which is not me, but the point being, like, this is very complicated historical stuff. Like, we can appreciate that women over time wearing less clothing and showing more of their bodies, whether you think that is a neutral thing, a good thing, a bad thing, whatever your opinion is, that's not what we're talking about right now. Whatever your opinion is, we can appreciate that that can't be put at the feet of black women rappers. Rap music is also very much heavily associated with black culture. It is born out of black culture. So if you're still here with me, which please, please like try and stick with the discomfort of hearing this feedback, please. I believe in you. I believe in you by ascribing something very negative, which in this case, this commenter is coming from the place of women wearing less clothing and being more revealing of their bodies as a negative, which again, we are not talking about whether people disagree that that is a negative or not. The point being is that by putting this negative quality at the feet of black women or something else at the feet of black people when we can like just do a little bit more critical thinking to understand that of course it's way 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 bigger than that that by putting it at the feet of black women that is an anti-black racist statement because we are picking out black people and putting something that is their responsibility which absolutely is not on them anyone who has been following my page for any length of time will know i try to be very clear that on this page we love we stand black women black women are unspeakably amazing. I am constantly in awe of black women, all black women from everywhere. And as an American, I have a particularly soft spot for African Americans. I owe so much to black women and of course, black people in general. If anyone who's watching this is Muslim, any of us who are children or grandchildren of immigrants who have come to the United States since the 1960s, since the Civil Rights Act, we have a direct debt to black civil rights activists for the existence of our parents, grandparents, and our existence in this country. So all of that is to say, on this page, if I've had a number of new people follow me, amazing, welcome. If this is the first time you're seeing my face, hi. Whatever the case may be, if you are going to stick around on my content, welcome. I'd love to have you here, but on this account, in all spaces that I am in, we support, we love, we respect black women. And respectfully to you, I am going to assume good intent. We're going to unlearn our anti-black racism and very much myself as well. I am going to continue to unlearn my own anti-black racism, but that is what we are going to do. And we are never going to say something disrespectful to black women. No, no.